Welcome to Vlogmas Day 22 because today is the 21st. Probably saw my Instagram stories, but I took off Vlogmas Day 20 because there's just been like so much going on. I know you guys know with Max testing positive, but he was asymptomatic. He still isn't sick, so that's the update on that because I know all of you guys are like worried and everyone's like, I hope he's feeling okay. And I'm like, he feels fine, just obviously can't see him, which stinks. But <clears throat> I'm leaving for Albany right now to see my family. You're probably like, where's Brody? Well, <laughs> you guys, it's just been a lot going on. So that's why I took one day off and all of you are very understanding and so sweet about it. Um, but basically, leaving for Albany right now, I left Brody here because Max actually gets to come home later today um, because since he's still testing positive, but asymptomatic, they're letting him come quarantine here, like finish his quarantine at the apartment. But his quarantine actually ends, they told him, on the 23rd or the 24th, I forget which day, because if you are asymptomatic with testing positive, they said that the protocol's changing like all the time, so it's just been like a mess trying to figure out what we're doing but yeah sadly I can't see him no matter what but what I was trying to say is his quarantine only needs to be seven days instead of ten since he's asymptomatic and so he can finish his quarantine here I'm gone anyway so it works out perfect and he might be able to go see his family for Christmas which is so nice because um, his quarantine will end so yeah that's that and I left Brody because he hasn't seen Brody in ages and he can be with Brody and yeah that is that I feel like my head is spinning there's been so much going on um but i'm so excited to finally go home with my mom my sister her boyfriend it's gonna be so fun so we'll bring you along with today it'll be for gas you guys look at the sunset it's so pretty huh anyway i feel like i've been driving forever i'm so dramatic it's only like a three hour drive but i am just tired and uh what else i've been listening to a lot of the what we said podcast i love them i'm like laughing their most recent one is like sort of christmasy themed stories and it's with their husbands and it's just so funny like i could listen to them i'll talk forever also i'm realizing did you guys see ah, i'm freaking out i don't know if you could even see in the clip earlier i might have been like too low look at this is like good lighting that you can see look at this necklace um hello it's a little M, I'm sure you can see. It's actually rose gold, which I don't know if you can tell. It might just look like gold gold, but it's rose gold with little diamonds because basically I opened this on FaceTime yesterday with Max. Luckily, most of my presents from Max to me for this Christmas were in Allentown, and so we just did FaceTime presents because we can't see each other um but i opened this and he literally got me a little tiffany m necklace with a little diamond it's so sweet i was like crying i need to like find a photo of me with the little blue box i was like you're kidding me like this is the sweetest thing ever and i'm just so obsessed with it i think it's so cute yeah so that's really sweet and wait till you guys see my other present you know we always do a what we got each other for christmas video but we aren't seeing each other so maybe we will just do one in like january if you even want to see that if you still care maybe comment down below on this video if you guys want to see what we got each other for christmas because we've always done that in the past but um it would literally be in like january and i'm usually i take like the first week of january off so <laughs> I don't know, but maybe I won't because I feel like I I don't know if I'll vlog after Christmas before New Year's So then that would be like taking two weeks off. I don't know, but we're gonna finish driving home I'm so excited to see everyone. It's way later. I'm realizing that I did not even Show you guys my family yet, but I was only home for like an hour or two before I came to yoga I just finished yoga here at anatomy in Albany. It was so good It was like just what I needed. It was I don't know how to put it other than it was just lovely the whole time in class I just kept thinking like this is just lovely and exactly what I was looking for I'm happy that it honestly was not that intense it kind of just felt like stretching in a hot room um, which I didn't think it was gonna be hot but it was like pretty warm in there but it was so slow paced just like stretchy vinyasa flow type of situation and yeah, that was so good for me because I haven't been to yoga in forever I feel like this is not focusing because it's like literally dark out but that was so good oh, I'm so happy I went to Daddy. Daddy. 
Teddy boy. <laughs> Teddy. Teddy, come here. Teddy, come. Are you ignoring me? Yeah, over here. There he is. Oh yeah. <laughs> he just slowly laid down. He is like a puppy cut right now. He's so soft. He like a puppy. Huh. Good morning. Good morning. So next month, actually it's afternoon now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I am combining yesterday and today I decided because I like mm -hmm. didn't vlog yesterday at all with anybody, like any of my family. Yeah. Um, I vlogged with Teddy He's for like busy. one second last night. We mm -hmm. watched Four Christmases. I love that movie so yeah, much. I just think it's like hilarious. I was laughing the whole time. Mm -hmm. And I showed them my lovely yoga moment. And now, tell them where we're going. We're going to get a Christmas tree at long last. <laughs> it's like the last Literally, day you can get one. Today's the 22nd. <laughs> I know, and I was talking to my friend and she was like, oh, that's nice that you can like have it for a long time. I'm like, well, I'd rather have it on the other side of Christmas so yeah, that before. I'm like leading up. Because instead it's just like, bam, there's your Christmas tree, here's Christmas. And then you're just like mourning Christmas and the Christmas Sad. tree's still there. <laughs> It's like more but, depressing. But it's <laughs> nice that they waited for me to get the Christmas tree. Oh yeah, tree. definitely. Um, yeah, I don't so think it would have happened without right you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we're going at long last. It's gonna be so nice. Mm -hmm. And we have Mandy coming, our cousin. My mom. Mm -hmm. I'm like explaining this horrible. My mm -hmm. mom's sister. She's like our aunt, our uncle, and our cousins, and our cousins yeah. are coming this weekend for Christmas mm -hmm. and it's gonna be so nice. Yeah. So we have a Christmas tree. So good to be home. Hi Lou. Hi. You haven't been in the vlog yet. We have those yet. LED lights that I have to return because I was, it was so hard finding Christmas lights. So I was, I've been hanging Christmas lights up on the trees outside. So what are those? Those ones like, like, oh, wait, look it. And like fine print it says like, like random blinking lights or something. And like, like they're like what? strobing Christmas yes, lights. like, <laughs> oh that's Spanish. I was like, why can't I read it? it? <laughs> Yeah, random sparkle. Like what? <laughs> random? What I don't want a random sparkle. It made me feel like I was losing my mind. And I didn't want those and I was upset. So then I went back and I went to a different Lowe's and they had like random like sparkle. all of the Goodbye. traditional just white ones. And so I was like lit and I got like eight I got I emptied off the shelf. Lit. I got all eight. And he was like, Yeah, we have like percent of our like Christmas like lights left random and I was like, Well, sparkle. I'm cleaning you out. Okay, cross your fingers, we're manifesting a perfect yeah. little Christmas. Christmas tree for us. Okay. Hopefully there are some left. I was yeah. asking if they had them at like Home Depot or Lowe's. I mean, I could call Home Depot. I don't know if they have real. You wait, you guys, know. I want them to see how this goes because we just called two Hewitts. Mm -hmm. And both, the first one was like, we have two left. They're quite thin. She goes, they're $25. And she goes, oh, my manager's yelling. We'll take we'll less take than less 25. Than <laughs> and this guy goes, we have three left. They're quite thin. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when you wait till the 22nd. Should I call Home Depot? And ask if they have real ones? Yeah. Sure. Good thing we're calling ahead because we would have driven in there. Like, no. hmm. Why don't I call? I'm going to call Fadigans. I feel like they always had the most. Let's, they did. Let's see. And especially because we always go It's our last hope, you guys. Hi. Um, I'm not sure if I clicked the right menu option, but I'm just wondering if you guys have any Christmas trees left. Okay. My God, uh, we're gonna have to go chop one down. <laughs> I don't know why I think this is so funny. Well, it's a little so thin typical. dinky. <laughs> I wanted to get one over this, like over the week. Good afternoon, this is Scott. How may I help you? Hi, um, I'm just calling to see if you have any Christmas trees left. Yeah, we have about 10 or so. Uh, they're okay. all about four, four and a half, five feet. They're Perfect, okay. Okay. Sounds good, thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Okay, there we go. We have 10 to choose from. Let's rock, baby. Okay, are you going to room me or should I room me? <laughs> it's like we never grew up here. Everywhere we go, we have to type in the I GPS. Know. I actually do know how to get there without a GPS. I can tell you. Well, I think I do too, but I mean like the <laughs> fastest way. That's what we're going We for. literally use ways everywhere. We oh, go. my God. <laughs> Hi, 
freaking laughing, you guys. I'm sure this oh should have been my like, god. Wait, this is really funny right now. Awesome. Thanks, Fadigans. They definitely had the most trees left, but they were like baby tiny. I left so my camera small. in the car. So we grabbed the biggest one we could find. It's probably like five feet tall. It was probably $72, you oh, yeah, guys. Maybe. Like five, because we're like five nine. Yeah. So like that's true. You yeah. guys, seventy-two dollars. Christmas trees are so expensive. And that was like a little teeny it's one. A tiny one. I, I feel like the like big ones we used to get like eight or like two hundred. No like they way. would be so much. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas is so good. But you know what? It's a Christmas spirit. Literally worth every penny. Can't wait to doll this baby up. Yeah, I mean, it'll smell <laughs> nice. It already smells nice. Like, oh get my some goodness. pine needles on it. I swear, ever since Brody's smudgy little nose is on this lens, that it hasn't, that it's been like smudgy. Yeah, it's been so freaking cold here. Anyway, it's later. Just wanted to update you guys mm -hmm. that we are going to hot hit. And I'm so excited because Lucy has hyped up this workout class for so long. And so I finally get to do it. Mm -hmm. I hate when the air is cold at first, yeah. even though it's heat. Um, and we're going. But basically, the instructor, her name's Dana. And I've done her She's hot incredible. bar. She's incredible. She's incredible. Like the energy is through the roof. Mm -hmm. She's so fun, like a little over a snapper. Literal energizer bunny. Like we'll yeah. kind of swear at you, but it's like funny and everyone loves it. Like literally the best vibes. Yeah. Not even not even swear at you. No, she's like, like like she's like, like she's sassy. Like, are you guys excited for today's class? Wait, that's like, all excited. Talk. And then and no one says anything. <laughs> she's like, okay, well we're getting started. Let's hope we find the energy or like whatever. Or she'll be like during the class. Like, yeah. yeah, she'll be like, oh my god, how's everyone doing back there? No one's answering me. Okay, great. Well, we're gonna keep going. And like, yeah. like I don't know. She's really funny. Like, yeah. Okay, we'll let you guys know how it went after. We're probably gonna be like soaked. Yeah. <laughs> guys, I get tomato red. Lucy gets like red red. Like that is not brake lights. Like look at me versus <laughs> And like my neck too. And I wait, come up, shirt. move up right here, then they can see because it's right right here. <laughs> I used to be like, I think it's because I have like asthma, and then now I'm like, I think it's just who I am. But during the class, I'm like, especially are you okay? when I'm like, like dumping run. my water on you. Especially when I run, yeah. I, like, I, mean, I just feel like my face just feels so hot. Like I can't. I, can't I feel breathe. like if your heart rate gets up, like feel how hot my face. I is. know, like all the blood just rushes to your face, and a lot of that was upside down type stuff, yeah. or like head down, stuff like on your wrist. mountain climber, jump, yeah. squat. I was just Boom. doing like elbow to knee, like by the end, knee to elbow, or rather. Yeah. At the end, you were still like hopping. I was like, I. Ugh, and yeah. I was doing like the girl push-ups. I was like, <laughs> tap me out. I did harder ones though with her. I guess I also pushed myself harder at the beginning because I was like, oh, like I can do like the first one I ever did because I didn't know how many times we were doing it through. And then she was like, again, again, again. I swear we did it five times. And I was like, at one point I was standing there like doing like the squat jumps or something. And I was like, either I'm gonna hit the floor or throw up. So either way, Wait, I need to like slow down. So I was wondering because it was all on the whiteboard. Yeah. So it's always that the same like five exercises and you do it like four times or five times. Per yeah. Day. Um, my land. And usually, sometimes you use the band. Sometimes you use like I don't know whatever. I feel like my heart rate is just so high the whole time. I'm like out of it. I know. And she's like, and bring your heart rate down now. I'm like, there's no time. Yeah, no, it's still <laughs> going up. There's no time. But yeah, we no, like she's fogged fun. up the car. I so couldn't much. even tell. Yeah, I couldn't even tell. Like she's like trying to like communicate with us after. I'm like, I literally can't. Even I know. I put on hand sanitizer. As I'm so out, like, but, like not conditioned. conditioned for that kind of yeah, workout. Like, I feel no, like no one is unless you like do it often. It, like reminded me of winter training for rowing almost. I know. Like like the first time I, I did, it, like, I was like I haven't. Stuff. Yeah. I was like I haven't done this in forever, and like it'd be like dead of summer, it'd be 105 in there, and I'd be like dripping pools of yeah, sweat, I'd be like no, running no. down it's my. So it was like 90, and when it's like jump, body. jump, lunge, squat, like ugh, I feel like I'm gonna puke. I feel like my my heart pounding in my ears, and I'm like. Yeah. Am I Gonna make it through this. <laughs> Woo! But it's it's we always did it. fun. It's always fun. It's always interesting. Oh, that reminds me of like how I feel after like weights. Just I, stuff that I don't feel can, afterwards. Like my whole body hurts. I just feel like sick. Like I need to just like lay down. That's why I really slow down <laughs> at the end. And she's like, oh yeah, there's like options to blah blah so blah. Like, and at the end, I'm like uh, like doing the options <sighs> to regress them or whatever. Because I'm like I don't need like, the I dumbbells. Throw I can me on barely a bike do or like a rowing machine or on a run mm -hmm. for a while and I'm good. But like the circuit high yeah, that's intensity like, and. Okay. and no. No. I know I'm like I think I swear anyone who thinks they're in shape can do that class and get their butt handed to them Yeah, <laughs> so even like even though I've been working out as much like I still oh, like so even hard. when I was working out It was so hard. Okay, we're gonna go do He's so 
happy I'm here, aren't you? He's probably so happy that he gets me without Brody. Remember when it was just me without Brody? He's probably always like, who is this annoying little dog that always bothers me? But now it's just me, back with you, Ted. I can tell he's so happy I'm back. Oh yeah, you're getting so much more attention. Anywho, um, you guys just saw I was doing dishes, but I try to just like make it fun, vibe out. I was playing a lot of Kit Moore, can like listen to a podcast, whatever. It's funny because I'm like home visiting family and I'm literally here alone right now, but with Ted of course, because Lucy and her boyfriend Dara, who I don't even think I've shown Dara yet, but they are out on like a little date. They're getting drinks nearby at this really cute place. And and my mom is running errands, like last minute Christmas shopping thing. So I made dinner. There's no way this is gonna look cute right now, but I promise it's so good. I love shepherd's pie, so good. And basically I had it as a Hello Fresh, like leftover. I never made it in Allentown, so I brought it here. I'm so happy I did because it was so good. So much fun cooking. I just feel so like at peace at home, like very nostalgic, just like cleaning up in the kitchen. I'm also like, this is the least I could do is like clean while I'm here because I was such a brat in high school and I'd be like mom I don't feel like cleaning up after myself you do the dishes like I just like cringe at like you know when I think back like you as like a preteen or even a teen could just be like so mean to your parents that's why I always tell any of my like younger cousins or anything like in high school I'm like be nice to your parents because it's everyone's biggest regret that they were like so mean anyway what I'm trying to say is we're just having a chill night and hanging. Yeah, I just feel like very at peace at home. Maybe because of you. Dogs really make a house feel like a home. I'm drinking a blue moon. <laughs> Look at me go. <laughs> I need to get our fire going. I think I forget how you do it, but Lucy always knows how. But Netflix literally knew that I was going to look up Emily in Paris. I saw Danielle Carolyn's Instagram story today that they added season two. I'm so freaking excited because I love season one. So Teddy and I are just going to hang out and watch some Emily in Paris. Lucy got the fire going. I need to turn that off, but it's so good, by the way. Love that show. And we're about to play Scattergories. This is like a Garrity family tradition at this point we've like loved this game for so long everyone I'm rolling the dice a I cannot believe that we all got an a vegetable okay everyone has to say what theirs was what was yours asparagus I was artichoke Dara I said aubergine you guys called it egg time. <laughs> I've never heard of that Lucy like Beautiful. that's incredible Woo! look at us go <laughs> Wait, what did you have for an, did you have a good ingredient or did you have nothing? You guys, it was ingredients and the letter was D. Yeah, but that, I feel like that kind of works. I feel like I would give you dark chocolate. But Lucy and I keep having the same answers for everything because we're twins, so we're on the same wavelength. And I go, I know we're going to have the same one for this one. And she goes, she goes, mom doesn't care. She waits for no one. And Lucy goes, Dale, you don't have Dale. And I'm like, I have Dale. And then, and then, and then Dara goes, I have Dale. And we all I said, family, we <laughs> <laughs> and we all said that we thought of it and thought we were so clever when we thought of Dale. Like, there was like, oh, nice, I thought of Dale. Uh, I thought of another one, Dijon, but it's like Dijon mustard or whatever. I feel know. like I'd give you That's Dijon. That's the type of mustard. <laughs> <laughs> I, know. Oh, yeah, well, I can't. We have the freaking category, please. Right, 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 